Hello everybody and welcome back to the second part of this Let's Build series slash tutorial. I've heard that a few of you have been trying to follow this design so well done with that and good luck with it. Um, as you can see from last time we've pretty much start like finished the, uh, the the main back face of the uh, of the building which is a, a modern modern style house. Um, I'm hoping this uploads in slightly better quality. The last one only went up to 10... 10? No it didn't. It only went up to 720. Uh, this should go up to 1080, I'm hoping, so fingers crossed this isn't absolutely terrible, or, yeah, could be, uh, could be a bit of a disaster. So, as I said before, we've finished the, uh, the back face of the house, all, almost, um, so today we're going to be working on the, the opposite face, and maybe the, uh, the, the, uh, interior, sorry. You know what, I thought I saw a cat in here? Um, we do have three cats uh, out the corner of my eye, but that's impossible because I know they're all downstairs and the uh, bedroom door is closed. So, there is a sheep down there and over there, but they're not cats, so we'll, uh, we'll, not, we'll not bother mentioning them. So apparently, uh, just before we begin last time, I wasn't talking enough. I'm not sure if I was talking enthusiastically enough because it is quite difficult to keep up this sort of invigorated persona throughout the entire 27 minutes that I record this. Um, so fingers crossed this will be a little bit better than last time if I struggle for any sort of subject matter relating to the build or that big floating island over there then I will try and sort of, I don't know, talk about my life and, and what I do. I'm sorry this has taken a week to come out. Um, I do have a job, I do work quite a lot these days and I, I travel quite far for my job as well. I, I travel about uh, two and a half hours every day to and from work uh, except on Sundays which is even longer but let's not get into that so let's start off with the build what's the daylight like yep should have plenty of time so let's begin I think we'll ease ourselves back into this it has been a week we'll start by laying down the floor in this uh, lower level and uh, yeah we're gonna use birchwood again keep the theme going oh hope if I actually connected these blocks uh, now this could take a while, so I'm just going to fast forward through all of this because I don't think you're going to want to watch me sort of filling in the entirety of the lower floor. So, yeah, enjoy this uh, sped up montage with hopefully quite epic music. and I've pretty much contracted some sort of horrible RSI type injury uh, from the repeated and very dull sort of blah, I can't even think of English basically I was squeezing these triggers far too much but um, yeah so we've now got the birchwood floor which looks significantly nicer than the grass floor um, obviously the top floor is the same like we need to keep some sort of theme going with this so I think it's important to uh, try and stick to that now one thing I did think of was that I do want to put a sort of window here and I think this might be a little bit too sort of close-knit so we're going to extend this out I think um, but not yet I sort of want to see how the rest of the house will look first like I say this isn't a tutorial I've never built this before that section there and the, and the bit of uh, above it was sort of pre-tested but the rest of it is sort of make it up as we go along which is how a lot of builds should be I think it's more fun if you don't know what you're doing so on with the uh, on with the build let's start off with this bottom floor bit so we're going to what are we going to do we're going to fill in the, the, the ceiling and this is going to be all white and um Basically, we're going to start building some of these lower rooms, putting some lights in, and seeing what sort of space we've got to work with for when it comes to furnishing it later. Now, I don't know if I'll record myself furnishing it. I think that might be a little bit boring. Um, however, I will sort of, once this project is finished, do a, a cut to and a tour of the completed house, fully furnished, so that you guys can get some ideas, and I'll sort of talk about how I've gone about furnishing it. Um, try and just bring this across to the wall. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna try and be a bit creative with the furnishing, but we'll, we'll see how that goes. I mean, 
there's not really a lot you can do. I mean, with this texture pack, you've got some pretty cool. Um, oh, that's not good. You've got some pretty cool uh, paintings and designs for some of the blocks that make decorating a house so much easier. But we'll just have to see what we've got to work with. So let's extend this out by one, so we can start building the walls properly down here. So we're going to take for this section some of the uh, birchwood slabs and we're going to take some birchwood stairs. Now we're going to fill in this wall again with the light grey wool because you know it's open plan but it's not that open plan. Oh, I think I'm about to do a new controller this thing does whatever it bloody likes. A bit like me only not at all I'm a good boy. So we're going to fill in this wall and we're going to fill in this wall all the way to the top and then we're going to come down here and do it this way because it's just that much easier and we're going to leave a three block height on this because when we come to putting the slabs on we can still walk under it and it still looks decent now it's very important that we've got at least a one block gap here between the, the ceiling and the uh, birch slabs otherwise what we're about to do next is going to look really off so I don't like how this ends here at all I think this looks horrific so it may be a case of filling this wall here and just filling it to the top. Now we can do something to fix this later on but for now we're just going to get the general layout of the downstairs to a point where we're happy with it. Bloody hell. Ah, oh, flipping, flippering thing. Okay and then the same here as we did on the other side we're going to take it all the way to the top bring this all the way along it's going to join there and then we're going to take this and I have just got a text probably from my fiance that's right I'm getting married um, not going to go too much into detail in that uh, it is my private life and I intend to keep it that way but um, those of you who sort of follow me on my old channel Jesus Ranch John will know that anyway that's pretty standard knowledge just give me a second to check this I'll be right back with you Okay, so I'm back and this room is looking incredibly dark, so we're going to take some of our glowstone blocks. We're not going to hide them for now, we're just going to place them. So we're going to pop one here, we're going to pop one here, and then again on the far side. Now this might still be a bit dark, but maybe we could pop one here for now. We may not keep it, but at least we can see what we're doing in the room. Now, this is not going to look 100% right, because obviously this is only one block, but you know it's the best we can do otherwise these would look weird so we're going to fill in all of this with upside down birch stairs to look like the, the ceiling's got a little bit of support again I'm sticking with the birch I like to just keep a theme with this because I think otherwise it could look messy now we could leave it like that potentially but let's just see how it looks filled in it might look crap but I don't know I think that's probably the best it's gonna look I mean We've got the outside to show that this is all joined in, so that looks alright actually. I'm, I'm quite happy with that. I mean, if you don't like it, you guys don't have to put it there. This is, like I say, just me and my preferences for this build. But I think that looks quite nifty. I think that, that makes a good sort of display. So, let's move on to this room and start working on the outside a little, I think. Um, yeah, let's start on this wall here. Now, what we might just do just because it's going to be easier for now, just fill this in. So we're going to take our light grey wool and ugh, it's awful, it's hideous. Fill this bit in a little bit just so it looks like something nice and workable. There we go, we've got a block of white wool and it looks fantastic and we're just going to keep it like that forever and it's going to look beautiful. No it's not. So we're going to take this all the way up to the same level as this ceiling bit and we're just going to fill this in now. Let's take our swiftness potion, which everybody uses. Oh, we don't want that one. No, we don't want that one. Get rid of it. We want a full swiftness potion so that we can be swift forever and be like the flash, only better. So we're going to go splooge, 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 splooge. Can't even say that as fast as I'm moving. That's how fast we are going. And we're just going to fill in this entire wall. Now we'll come back and make this a bit prettier later on, but for now it's just important that we've got something that looks a bit more neat. Sort of a blank canvas to work from. So we're going to take this all the way up to the same level, which is taking ages and ages, but never mind. What? How did 
did you get up? No, no cows allowed. Ah, oh, you mock me cow. You will mock me no more. You will leave. Ah! Oh. Don't give me those eyes. You know what you're doing. Ah! Oh. Oh, get out of my stairs. Go on. Go on, leave. Leave. Showed him. See? No uh, no cow dares to uh, to face the mic. This is my block of grey wool. So we're going to take this all the way here. And all the way here. Leave. Miss that block. That's totally totally meant to do that. That's totally fine to leave that. No, we'll fill that in. And congratulations. We've got a blank white wall that looks absolutely disgusting. Now what we're going to do is possibly fill this ceiling bit in, I think. Just so that we know where the ceiling's going to come to. Maybe take that up one more, actually. Yeah, we'll take that up one more. And, uh, yeah. This is going to look brilliant. I can already tell. This is going to be amazing. So this can come to here. That's the good thing about modern builds, is that anything that juts out, you can make it work. So this could work as something later on. I'm not entirely sure what, though. So this is sort of going to be where the ceiling comes to, and it's going to come all the way up here and around to there. And the purpose of this, you might ask, we fill this in. We'll only go to the wall of the bedroom so that we can see what we're doing. This will be where the wall is. And of course the bedroom wall will come here. And as such, voila. Okay, so we're going to pop in this section here another light just so that we've got some lighting there and you guessed it we're gonna go for our old friend the upside down birch slabs just because you know they look more ooh, been there look more believable I think I think they give credibility to this to this build leave them there for now they don't have to be perfect but I think that looks nice you know the idea of something don't know what but something 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 so, fill in this bit of stairs here as well, all the way, not to the top I don't think, I don't think we'll be filling in the stairs completely, but at least to this sort of area. There we go, because then what we can do is delete this section and even bring this out a little bit further, even if it's just like a, a little window that we end up having here, I think it'll work quite nicely. So, if we assume that the ceiling is here, which it is, I think, is that where the ceiling's going to be? Is that too low? One way to find out. No, nope, that's where the ceiling is. Right, it's getting dark, so I'll just have a quick nap, and then uh, I shall return once the, uh, the daylight has come and the creepers have disappeared. And we're back! Jesus, I've just che checked the... That little... What is this son of a bitch doing? I've warned you once. You're not 18, you can't come in here. Ah, oh, you... Curse you! Fooled me again! I've just checked the recording, this is about 17 minutes, but that's without editing, so I'm going to keep going. Um, yeah, we're going to keep having a look and seeing what we can do with this. Now, I think this could possibly be extended out a little bit more. Um, maybe all the way so it links up with the bedroom but we'll, we shall see we shall see it doesn't have to do anything I was thinking maybe putting a window here but we'll, we'll have a look we'll see how it looks we'll see how it looks as it was oh I don't you just hate gate crashers especially when gate crashers are cows though some could argue that all gate crashers are indeed cows so we've sort of done the stairwell we'll come back and pretty it up but first we shall take some more of our glorious black wool and we shall make a window here I believe so quite how we're going to make a window here I don't know I'm thinking destroy all of this and see what we can see oh yeah letting in plenty of light baby so I'm feeling maybe you know what? I can't even remember how I designed the other windows okay so this comes in this goes out okay that's something 
something or another. So, let's assume nothing. We never assume anything. Right, um, let's try it like this. Take this up here, like so. I don't know if this will work, but it's worth having a look, isn't it, I suppose. Um, and we put... Oh, I don't even know anymore! Right, um... Yes, we put this like, like this. Take this all the way to the top, and I've got another text, so I shall be back with you in a second. And we are back again. Um, what was I doing? I don't even know what I was doing anymore. No. Right, so, we'll take this up. Hang on, if we're doing that, then surely... No, because then that'd look weird on that. Okay, we'll just keep this at sort of two. Take this up like so. Leave that like that, maybe? Mayhaps? I don't quite know. Um could be something. could be crap. Uh, then again, if we're doing that, then surely we could just take this up by the one block here. Delete, 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 get rid of, start anew. And like so. Ooh, too late. Let's have a giant window there, why not? Why not? Why the hell not? Okay. So what we can do is, 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 take our black wool again and bring this out by one, and the same up here, and around here, and down, and we've got our black wool setting, and now this is going to be the bit where it starts to get a bit ridiculous, I think, I think this might have been a terrible, terrible idea, because when we take all of this up like this, and then around here because I like depth in my builds, I think if you're not doing depth it's, it's alright but I don't know, personal preference says that everything has to look deep and like it's actually set in and not just glued on that just looks weird we'll try it, we'll try it, it could be, could be naff but you know God sent us to try us and he sent me to try Minecraft so let's try filling in this top bit Oh look, there's a little island over there. It's quite cute. Maybe maybe in a future episode we'll go and build something over there. But uh, it'd be a shame to destroy the natural wonder. Now hang on. That could be quite nice on its own. Just sort of a black... Black bit. What if? Because this is going to have to come to here anyway. We extend this by one. Like so. And we can use this for some sort of decal bit later. That might work. Do the same on the other side. But uh, we shall see. Let's fill in this bit for now so we know where we're at. Because it's not where you're from, it's where you're at. That's all filled in. And voila, we have one very, very large window that sort of doesn't look like anything. Um, okay. Wow, I don't even know how we'd join this. Um, I suppose we could bring sort of two lines here. Only it joins with that. No. Although... No, this is three. We can't do this. We cannot do this! It's not allowed. What we could do... Perhaps... Is... I don't know. I don't know what we could do anymore. Um... Let's try deleting some of this for now. Taking this out by one. Like I say, this isn't a tutorial, this is just me making it up as I go along. Sort of how I do everything in my life. Um, let's delete this bit here. Delete, delete, delete. Fill, 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 fill. Who's Phil? I don't know. Maybe you guys know Phil. Tell him to come and help me with this build. Um, I think maybe I could even thin this out a little bit just because I think it's too wide at the moment. 
So what we could do is go like so. Just at the minute, I don't want to walk across this walkway anyway, and it's quite easy to get onto this sort of ledge. We'll delete that. That looks a little bit better. Not much, but you know, serviceable. Then we could delete this bit here and do the same here, maybe. Because I think long and thin works better than just thick and bulky. And that's not an innuendo. Um, yeah, that looks a little bit better, I think. And if we take this round here again, sort of delete this. What, what are you doing here? Why are you. Did I not fill this bit? Oh, I made a mistake with it, as I make a mistake with everything. Okay, so we're going to delete this as far as up here. And we're going to fill this black. And it is absolutely awful weather outside. I can just literally hear the window panes rattling in my bedroom window. Um, this is all wrong. I don't know why I've just filled this bit in. No! Go. Be away from me. So, what we're going to do is just fill this bit in here. <coughs> God, what happened to my voice then? As such... I'm just going to neaten this up a bit now. God, I can't believe I spent so much time on this window. It's not even brilliant. It's like the worst looking window ever. Um, so just delete, 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 delete. God, this is so much effort. Um, delete, delete. I probably won't even end up keeping this window. This is how annoyed I am. Uh, fill this up here. And then the same all down here. There we go. I think that's good. Let's drink a potion of swiftness to celebrate. See, it looks a little bit neater now. It's long and thin rather than... Is this... No, that's one. That's okay. That's okay. My mind was playing tricks on me. So, what can we do here? Let's take some stone, maybe. We could go one, two, three. 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 Add a sort of support to it, maybe? Take this out one more. Would this just look weird? I don't know, what do you think, Mr. Pig? He has no opinion, he can't talk English. Blah, 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 blah. There we go. I suppose it adds a bit of depth to it, doesn't it? It adds something. Something shit, no doubt, but something. Okay. Hmm. Even if it's a case of just putting something here, like a small design, like something going up. We could do that, I suppose. Let's try that. Let's try two. Let's take this out the same distance as this, maybe. Follow this all the way down. God, it's getting dark again already. It is. The, the time just flies. Um, and fill this up. That adds a shape. Again. Curve it over here so it continues somewhat. I don't know. I don't know if we'll keep that. We'll come back to it. Uh, in a second. And we're back as the sun rises over our build. It still looks alright, but not fantastic. But we'll come back and fix it later, I suppose. Um, for now, let's continue on with this far side bit because it's just sort of like cut in half here. It doesn't really work. Um, but let's fill up this bit here. Oh, not with stone. No, never with stone. There we go. And uh, we'll fill in the ceiling while we're here, why not? Why not fill in this bit of wall that will become the front door? There we go. Now what we could almost do here is sort of a strange door design, where we go plonk. Let's pop in, I don't know, what would look like a welcome mat? Something interesting, but not completely out of place. Um, I don't know. Brown wool would look strange, I suppose. Uh, let's try it. Let's give it a go. If you don't try it, you never know. Doesn't work for everything. You shouldn't try murder. That works as a sort of welcome matty type thing. And then we'll just take a door and go to wherever the doors live. There we go. And we'll plonk that in there. Does that work? Does that look anything near decent? It's looks strange, doesn't it? Okay, so we won't go with that. That looks terrible. We'll just fill in the door for now. We'll come back and we'll drop off the edge. We'll come back and try this again to make it neater later on, I suppose. But, um, yeah, for now, let's fill in this bit of ceiling. Let's fill this so we know how far we're going. All the way. Forever and ever. And we'll fill this all the way to the back here. 
and then pop that bit there if you like, I don't prefer it. Fill this in here. This is just as far as the bedroom goes at the minute. We might even end up extending the bedroom, but I'm not entirely sure yet. I don't think so. I think we could potentially have a balcony here. Or at least a walkway to the balcony. We'll have, we'll have a look. We'll test some things. It's always fun to test. So, we're going to drag this all the way here. And basically do what we've already done. So I'm just going to speed this section up. Because, you know, it's boring watching walls go up. It's almost like watching paint dry, isn't it? Okay, and we're back. So, the wall is now filled in. And it is not too dark down here but that's probably because of this giant shaft of light poking out the top but regardless we're going to put a light here and we're going to put one here no not in the wall why would I put it there light wall and here I'm not too sure what I'm going to do but I'm thinking of making this into a sort of closet area so if we fill this up to about here put a bit there maybe a half slab and then something there. We could fill that up with chests or whatever took our hearts. Hearts design. Uh, here we maybe put a plant. Pop one here. Why not? Um, yeah, so this is sort of the layout for the entrance and whatever room this is going to be. Uh, yes, yeah, so the only bit to really finish filling out. Oh no. Oh, look what we forgot to do, ladies and gentlemen. We forgot, let's take this up there, might as well keep it neat, we're not going to need that many chests, this isn't for actual uh, survival gameplay necessarily. Let's fill this here, so I'm thinking maybe if we take this bit here, do that, and maybe pop a ceiling bit there, might look weird, let's take it down by one more. Then can we walk under this and not bash our heads? No, we can't. It is always good. It's always good to bash your head. There we go, that's a lot better. Only just. You've still got a duck to get underneath it, but it doesn't look... What the... Now the game's doing what it wants, Jesus. Okay, um... Not the best looking section, but... Saying that, it's not too bad either. Um... Yeah, so this is going to be obviously our stairway up to the uh, second, or the first floor rather, not the second floor. And we can just fill this bit in here. Take away this. Go walk out the door, or knock off the floor. Uh, delete this bit here. There we go. This could lead out to some sort of exterior balcony on this side. Ooh, I'll just shuffle myself around. Bear with, bear with. Um, yeah, so this is starting to look like a room, I suppose. If what we do is take this here now, we don't need this here, and take this down a bit, uh, just fill in this wall for now, we'll fill in this section, and fill this into. Now you see that looks strange, doesn't it? Might have to take this back by one. Uh, hmm. Not too sure I like that. I don't really want to take this out by one more if I can help it. Um, hmm. Okay, so I've just sort of neatened this out as well, made this more symmetrical because I'm a stickler for symmetry. So we'll fill in this wall, and this will start to look a little bit neater. Fill in this wall as well, just so that we've got an actual sort of door area to sort of come out of. And let's take some glass panes, and we'll get rid of the ice for now. And we'll just sort of do a sort of nice little modern walkway here so that you don't fall through and hurt yourself. We'll take that to there. Mm, yeah. Yeah. Looks alright though. You're not going to go down there. You're not going to fall down the stairs and hurt yourself. we we'll come down here. Look. Oh, look, it's magical. Beautiful. It's gorgeous. Everybody loves it. Everybody except me. There's something missing here, but I can't quite figure out what it is. It might just be a case of doing this here, but that just looks horrible. Let's leave it. If in doubt, leave it. It will work itself out later. There's a quote for you. Now, the bit we need to still sort for this interior is the bathroom, so we'll do that now. Okay, 
Okay, it's daytime again, and we're just going to do something here for now. So we filled in that wall, and uh, yeah, it's starting to look like something quite serviceable. Now what I am going to do is just take this out by one more, because I do not like blocks that can join strangely. So we'll take this away, because nobody wants to see it. Ooh. And we'll knock a giant hole there, because why not? Uh, yeah, so we'll take this round. And there we go, so we've got a sort of joiny, joiny bit. We will fill this in later. This will be one of the last things we do, I think, because it's just going to be a sort of garden area. Whereas round here, I think we're going to extend the bedroom a bit. There we go. Blah, 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 blah. Because this is going to be a walkway as well. So, we'll leave actually doing the bedroom for now. Because we're still working on the bottom bit, which I will get back to. And I'll keep sort of disappearing from it. But, you know, that's what we'll do now. I can't keep disappearing from it. I cannot run from responsibility anymore. I'm an adult. Right. So, we'll take our lighting again. And we'll bring it here and here for now. Just because this is going to be ice, I think. All we could do is something a bit more interesting. This actually, we could go here and here. And... Ooh. Oh dear. No. Um. No, it doesn't work at all. Isn't that awful? No. How bizarre. Very light, and then not light at all. Um. Don't quite know what to do with this. I think what? Well, yeah, we'll just stick with ice for this. So. Just the usual go find our ice block and uh, yeah we'll just drag this in by a couple one two one two one two one two break a breaker one two fill this in and then the huge there we go and then on the center block here oh, fill that in as well haven't I? Oh, that's not look very good we will put our ice block there we go and uh, yep, so we'll fill in the ceiling as per order because God knows we don't want someone falling down from upstairs and watching us have a bath or worse. So yeah, that looks alright. So it's a bit of a darker room, but we'll fix it. So what we're going to do is we are now going to fill in the bedroom finally. <laughs> knock out a window. Now, I did do something similar to this on a previous build I was testing but it, I don't know how well it works so you'll have to bear with me with this. But we'll knock all of this out. in there, or that tree there, or that giant gaping hole to Satan's arse down there, or a swamp, mmm, delicious swamp. So what we'll do now is we'll go back to the outside, let's uh, extend this again by three, which is a lot when you think about it. So let's carry on now, I'm not entirely sure what I'm going to do here at the minute. Um, I don't know what would be for the best. Don't even know if this wants to be anything anymore. Um, just sort of need to extend somehow. Let's try taking this out and seeing if this can be anything. Um, even if it just goes to here, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Could just be like a garden, maybe, where we pop plants and stuff. Would that work? Would that be anything useful? I'm not entirely sure anymore. Um, I suppose that does become a sort of stranger shape. Could that work though? Wouldn't be too strange is my question. I really don't know what we're doing with this bit anymore. Um, I suppose what we could do maybe is see how this would look as a window. So if we took that as far as that and brought this down, where would this take us? Where would it leave us? Sort of there. 
which isn't the best sort of position to have. Um, unless what we did is bring this to here, maybe? Then that looks crap as well. Um, I could take it just as far as that. Delete, 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 delete. Fill, 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 fill for ever and ever. Never forget. That could work, I suppose. It's not going to look great, but, you know, it's Minecraft, what can we do? And then what we'll do is... Now I have actually taken this out by one more just so that it uh, juts out from here rather than goes on the same level because that would look terrible. But uh, yeah, I think this looks okay. I don't think there's any light that's really going to cause too much trouble for the ice which is going to sit on this level but we'll fill it in anyway and we'll see how wrong I am. Well it's not melting. Usually there's some sort of ice melt by now. This is just a nice long window to the corridor, which we can access now through this bit. Oh, yes, let's go across the roof like some sort of Spider-Man figure. Uh, and let's fill in this bit of ceiling walkway bit, just so that... Uh, or actually, what we could do, I suppose, is go like so. And then get some more of our glass panes our black wool which we don't need anymore and fill that in like that take that just fill that in there and that could be like I don't know some sort of lucky bit it looks up there yeah you can see up to the top now that's snazzy isn't it and you can look out the window all the trees and the swamps but the the basic shape of the building is pretty much done I mean there's some more windows to place and whatnot but Let's take some stone very quickly. I will finish this build up eventually. So where's this sort of centre? It's a sort of two block centre. Fill this in here just so it's got some sort of realistic looking support. And uh, yeah, fill this in. Maybe even take away this centre bit. So add more shape. No, one lower. Could work. We could do that with the other side as well. Gosh, I'm never going to close this thing. Are we? So we fill that there, like that, and one like that. No, that's hideous. It's awful. Um, can't if this was centralised, wouldn't it? Let's have a look. Let's take one more out. There we go. And even if so, like here, we could just go like that and pop in another shape just to add depth, because depth is always good. Okay, so I think that's going to be it for today, guys. I'm sorry that we haven't seemingly got as much done as last time, but I promise you we have. Um, when we come back in the next episode, we'll finish off making sure all the walls look really well decorated and modern. We'll do the back garden area, we'll work on the ceiling, and then we can maybe, depending if I feel like doing it on camera or off, uh, furnish the building, which, you know, we'll... I'll show you the finished product anyway, but, you know, that's that's it so far. Um, yeah. So until next time, guys, I'm John. This has been, and now from Britain's, Let's Build a Modern House Part 2. Um, I'm sure, I'm, hopefully it won't take another week to get the next part out, but we'll we'll have a look. We'll give it a go, and I'll do my best by you as always. So thank you very much for watching. Please subscribe, please comment, and uh, yeah, good luck if you're trying to copy this build. Best of luck to you. Goodbye. As a bonus to those of you who've watched the end of the video, look who I found. It's that bloody cow again, the one who was tormenting us throughout this whole build. Now, the little shit thought he'd got away with it, but clearly he hasn't. He's uh, trapped in here now, and he really wants this piece of wheat. Um, look at those eyes. He knows. He's, he's, he's like a drug addict looking for his wheat. Um, 
but he's not going to get wheat, and we're going to give this little cow exactly what it deserves. So, yeah, goodbye, bovine friend. Oh, shit. I hope you enjoyed that. Well, he appears to have turned into an apple, which is always a good sign. My little uh, apple friend will keep that. And we'll uh, give that pride of place in a later episode. We'll put it on the wall as a sort of trophy. So yeah, once again I've been John and thank you for watching this build. And uh, yeah, if you don't subscribe you'll get the same fate as that cow.